Hi guys, it's Megan Rose from the Philippines. Today is August 24, 2018, a Friday. It's my Auntie Ellie's birthday today. Uh, so welcome to my channel. It is called Ganchillera. A uh, show and tell of crochet and craft related items. So what have been what have I been up to this last week? I have been working on the baby set that my Ate Didit ordered for me. But before completing that, I was asked to make three baby sandals of different designs. So I was working on that this past week. So those are these baby sandals with this type of design. So yesterday I was assembling the back part and the front part and I was able to make this type of flowers. I was experimenting on them and this is the first one that I made but I wasn't satisfied with this so I decided to work on this ones and also made another set for the other booties with these colors and I was also working on some rose type of uh, embellishment for the sandals so I was working on this. And this is composed of 40 chains and some 17 V stitches. Then after that, you're going to work on some scallops. You're going to turn this around. And then you're going to sew it at the back. So since I have that, I have another design that she asked. And this is the other one. So I lessened the number of scallops for this because the booties is so small. I have seen the baby already and she's about 2 months now. So this is a, this September she's going to wear the baby set that I that was asked of me. So I was going to also make this part a uh, crochet around the garter but I just decided to put a button in it rather than the garter one because I was quite apprehensive about it yesterday about the measurement so since I have seen the baby already I have measured her feet part and the other part of her body so I can estimate working on the baby set so since I was working with that I just decided to work on another booties that I made from before so I worked on this also and it also has that flower design so this is going to be my sample for when I go somewhere and I can let people see it so if they want to buy from me they can then a while ago, I was working on this other one, but I decided to show you this finished on my next podcast. And I have also made uh, three sets of soles that I'm going to experiment on with other designs. I'm going to research on that. So those are most of my crochet projects. And I have been busy also working on tutorials for my beaded item. And recently, I have made a tutorial about this oblong type of wallet with the X design. So I didn't put uh, lining and zipper on this yet. But this is how it is when you put the lining. Uh, I will put a link on the description box for this tutorial or maybe on the end screen so this is one of them if you put a cream colored gino cloth you will see the x design but if you use a gray color it wouldn't be that visible so i have shown you these two samples from before and i'm still on the experimenting stage for my beaded tutorials so I have been uh, experimenting on them and thinking about other designs so I came up with this one this is supposed to be a cell holder but 
came out a little bit wide it has that uh, circle design on the side parts of it just like a border line so I wanted to make a tutorial for this and I also experimented on another one just like this it's some type of bag like wallet it's just an accident that I made this I made it using this um, flat cluster of six and I connected it on the side parts so since I have made this I have also made a sample for a, a cell holder because I made one of this from before so this is it and I'm hoping to make a tutorial for this it has different elements to it like the embellishment flowers the side design the flap and this handle with the circle design so I'm thinking that this is going to be a long tutorial so I am studying it and I'm hoping to make one soon so since I have that I made another one using some gray and yellow yarn for my next sample so I'm just working on those projects as I go uh, working on some orders also on the side I am collecting some monster amigurumis as you know so since that night I wanted to make some diamond art painting I was also working on that uh, in the after I have wash the dishes and it's pretty exciting to work on the diamond painting lately so i have some progress with it so for this type of project i have been using some alligator clips for the plastic part so that i can work on it I'm just going to show you the segment that I have been working on. So I have made most parts of this bottom part. And I'm working up as I go. And I have been working on this at night. So I'm thinking that there is more part of them that I need to work on so that is pretty exciting to work on that and this is from Miss Grace of GB Maltese and she has been making some uh, tutorials or unboxing of her diamond painting so hi Miss Grace <laughs> so so recently Daniel has been playing with this dino tail that I made from before he doesn't want to take it off and he is wearing it while he, are, while he is sleeping so I have shown you this from before but this is one of my projects and this is some type of sewn dino tail using some Gina cloth and I found a DIY tutorial for this so that is how I made it because from before one of my cousin's wife uh, asked me to make her some of this for the seventh birthday of his of her son and I remember working on this and making some of them for Nicole, Makmak, Marius and Sophie so Daniel wasn't uh, born yet and so now this is the last one that was left of the dino tail so he just loves uh, wearing it and he's quite happy uh, acting like a dinosaur wearing it so those are most of my projects and I don't know what else to say I want to thank my new and old subscribers um, thank you for supporting me and thank you for always watching my videos 
And if you have questions for me uh, or su any suggestions, uh, please put them on the comment box below. I want to hear from you guys. So I think those are most of it. I need to meet with my Ate Dorina later. So I can give her her order of Judas pouches. She's going to get the three of them. And we're going to meet at Pure Gold Pretil. So, Mama is not here. She went to the barangay for some cash gift for the senior citizens of our barangay. One of our congressmen uh, held that type of event. And he's going to give away some cash gifts to the senior citizens. So, Mama and Papa are working on that. They are uh, making some Xerox of their IDs. And I was hearing it from my neighbor that she went there also and the line is very long. So, I think those are most of it. Today here, it is sunny. Uh, but we have a storm on the upper part of the Philippines that is going to Taiwan now. And I think that storm is going to pass through and going out of our location this evening. And the kids, they have school today. So they went there and it is still morning so I decided to make a video. So I'm rambling now so I'm just going to let you go. And I hope you guys have a fantastic time crafting or some family bonding time. That's it for me. Bye for now.